Welcome to the Titus Timeout Podcast. My name is Jason Letterman, Product Manager for Titus Fan Cool and Blower Cool Products. Today I'll explain the role of a balancing valve and highlight where they're typically seen and calculated in multi floor fan cool applications. So let's begin by sketching a simple chiller fan cool application. The role of the balancing valve is to control the gallon per minute flow rate in a system. This can be seen in building mains, risers, and branches which deliver the design GPM flow. Additionally, at each fan coil, a balancing valve is set to provide precise flow rates specified by the design engineer to provide comfort and energy efficiency within the building. We sketched a simple hydronic system with a building main, two risers noted as riser A and riser B, along with two branches or floors of which have three rooms. Each room will have a fan coil requiring two GPM for operation. So where exactly should the balancing valves be located in the system? Let's start with the risers. In order to control the rate of flow back to the boiler or chiller, each riser return line will receive a balancing valve to control the flow. Starting with riser A, it has six fan coils that require a 2 GPM flow rate to meet the design requirements, and riser B also has six fan coils that require 2 GPM per design. The total design flow per riser will be 6 fan coils at 2 GPM equaling 12 GPM. Noted earlier in the podcast, the balancing valves will also be applied on the main supply line, the branch returns, and the fan coil returns. Let's now indicate their loca- location and sizing. The main supply line will require a valve to control the rate of water at 24 GPM. This is determined by the number of return risers in the system. Each branch return line will have its own balancing valve to ensure the flow rate is 6 GPM, which is 3 fan coils at 2 GPM. And finally, each fan coil return line will need to control the flow rate through the coil to 2 GPM. Through the example illustrated today, we've shown how we size and position the balancing valves along with the role of each valve in our system. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and thanks for taking the time out.